Long season, a lot of football to be played, and uh, let's just kick the show off with one of the most anticipated games of not only the week, but maybe the season. It's our nine overtime game of the week, a District 1-5A Division 2 matchup between Del Valle and Cano Teo. First quarter, Del Valle on the drive. It's Jake Fetty. Jason, the arm on Fetty on this one, just well, amazing, all right? You know what? He's got a strong arm, but he also has arm talent. Uh, strong arm can get the ball out there, but arm talent will get you the ball exactly where it needs to be. And then just two play later, so it's going to be Fetty again with the quarterback sneak. Del Valle up 7 nothing. Jason, I just want to talk about that once again. I mean, he just is a definition of RPO. Yeah, for sure. It looks like a replay of last week. Uh, you know, when Jetty, excuse me, when Fetty, which is Jetty, Jetty yeah. uh, uh, like puts on those jets, it's going to be really hard to uh, stop. Later on, 12 seconds left in the quarter. It's a Fetty connecting with Dylan Gonzalez with the grab. Let's go. Does that, does that count as a Moss? <laughs> yeah, a little bit. Uh, shout out to Dilly, man. Don Haskins and Don Haskins. All right, we'll head into the third quarter now. Matthew Gasca to Lalo Carrillo, 37-yard touchdown. Eagles will finally get up on the board with this play here. The Eagles building some momentum. Still down a lot, but Del Valle was just way too much for Cano Teo on this one. If Jake Fetty's not enough, you've also got this guy, Jason. Yeah, you got Manny Fuller, man. This is really hard to contain. This is the best offense right now in the city. Yeah, best offense. Del Valle putting it on Cano Teo. Final score 31 to 14. Conquistadores with the dub. And now let's send things out to Jesus Baltazar, who is live with the Valle head coach Rudy Contreras and Jake Fetty. Del Valle has put themselves at the driver's seat of district play with tonight's 31-14 win over the Canotillo Eagles. I'm joined now by Del Valle head football coach Rudy Contreras. Coach, earlier this week you spoke about, you know, there's been a lot of hype behind your offense, but you spoke about your defense wanting to prove mm -hmm. something tonight, and they certainly seem to do so. They did, you know. Uh, a lot of credit to them over there. They have a really good defense, but you know what? Our guys had something to prove tonight, and they did. They came out here and played extremely well. Uh, had some big time stops for us and then gave our offense some opportunities to make some plays down the stretch. So it was a, a team effort and a great win. Now you also described this matchup as championship week. Tell me what was your mentality for the team heading into this tough matchup on the road? We have a lot of championship weeks. You know, it's, it's championship week because it's the next game. Uh, but our schedule this year, we have a lot of tough games on the road and uh, we're battle tested and we want to come out here and just show that we can get the, a big win on the road. And we did tonight. Coach, congrats. Thank you. Appreciate it. My pleasure. Now I'm joined by Del Valle quarterback Jake Fetty. Jake, uh, coming into this game, uh, there's been a lot of talk about Canutillo's defense being one of the toughest units in the borderland. And they did make difficult uh, things difficult for you guys for a while. But ultimately, you guys put up 31 points and you yourself delivered another, another stellar performance. What was your mentality of uh, facing that defense tonight? You know, all week we heard they got dudes. We knew they had dudes. We, we saw them last year. And they're, they're a tough physical team, but we got dudes too. We, we take our the guys on our side of the ball over the dudes on theirs any day. Jake, one more question. This looked like one of the toughest matches on your schedule. How do you feel coming out of this with a W? To be a good team like that, especially on the road, it feels real good. It's a good team win. Jake, congrats again. Thank you. Thank you. Well, that'll do it for our nine overtime game of the week. This is the second time we've seen Del Valle go on the road on a tough heavyweight matchup and come out with a statement win, this time over the Canutillo Eagles, 31-14. Guys, I'll send it back to you in the studio. All right, Jesus, thank you. Jason, Jesus said it himself, a statement win out of Del Valle. What are some of your main takeaways from this evening? You know what? That was the best defense in the city went up against the best offense in the city. But I like what Coach Contreras said. Uh, all the hype was there, but it's only one game. On to the next. Yeah, but big, big ahead. win for District yeah, there for, for the uh, Del Valle Conquistadores.